Spokane Valley seniors are in the midst of a power play of their own. It's an all-out smackdown over a ping-pong table at Center Park Senior Center. DXY4 Sally Showman is live in the studio to explain. Dave, a ping pong table that the seniors have been playing on for years was taken away this week. It was taken to another location where they have to pay a dollar to play. The seniors are irate. They want their ping pong table back. The board says there's no chance. These old guys' hearts are beating quickly today, but it's not from exercise and it's certainly not from ping pong. It's because they're mad. We're here because they've taken our ping pong tables and moved them. They marched in here and no uncertain terms told us we couldn't even talk about it. Center Park Senior Center houses pool tables, bingo, oh, yeah. crafts, and until last Friday it housed a ping pong table too. President of the Senior Center Board, Mary Alice Nelson, says Center Park was happy to provide one ping pong table, but the men kept asking for another one. We do not have the facility for it. Sick of the arguing, the board pulled the plug, or the table, and moved it to a community center where it costs a buck per game to play. And that's when, when the, the fit hit the shan. Because of safety issues, and we found them a place to play, I don't think they have anything to complain about. The men say they feel as if they're elementary boys who have been grounded. They tend to treat us like children, like we're just going to roll over and say, eh, whatever. When you act like children, you get treated like children. These men are zipping up their paddle bags for today, but they say they won't let up. There are members here that fought in World War II. And that, they fought to save democracy. This is a small deal. It's ping pong in a small town, but uh, it's, it's still democracy, and this is how we keep it going. Now, the board of directors say there are, real, are rules and regulations about how much room each ping pong table needs, and there isn't enough space there. They also say their safety concerns are real. In fact, they say someone broke their arm while playing ping pong a while back. In the newsroom tonight, Sally Showman, KXLY4 HD News.